So after you've plugged in your SD card through an SD card reader or an SD card slot, we can go ahead and click on SD card data recovery and we'll click on next. And then we'll select our source or our card in this case and click on next. And now we have some choices of how we want to scan these files. You can do a quick scan for deleted files, which will search through the surface level scan. You can scan for all files, which goes much deeper. However, it takes a lot more time. And you can go even further by turning it into advanced mode, which does an even deeper scan, but again, takes a lot more time. In this case, we're just gonna do a simple scan and click on next. And now it's going to scan our micro SD card for any data. And now that the scan is finished, we can go in and actually preview our files we want to recover. So I'll go ahead and select the ones I want to save and click on the recover button. Then I'll select an output location and then click on recover. And now all of those files will be saved into this directory here, now backing them up onto our computer. That is it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. That is how you use the Android SD card data recovery feature.